So maybe I think it might taste better when you put this in the fridge. Thank you. What's up my fluffy bun? So today I'm going to be making some chocolate chocolate chip cupcakes by Sarah Kim which I'll leave the links and the recipe all down in the description. Also go subscribe to her. She does very awesome like cooking or baking content. So let's just get started. So first you're going to need one third cup of vegetable oil. Then you're going to need 133 grams of white sugar. Then you're gonna need one room temperature egg. Then I'm gonna add 161 grams of room temperature plain yogurt. Then I'm gonna add two thirds of a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Then I'm gonna add one third cup of room temperature milk. Then I'm gonna add 180 grams of all purpose flour that needs to be sifted. Then I'm going to add 12 grams of cocoa powder and a half teaspoon of baking soda that needs to be sifted. Then I'm going to add 104 grams of chocolate chips. So these cupcakes makes about 12 cupcakes and make sure to preheat your oven for 400 Fahrenheit and wait for about 20 minutes and then cool off for about 15 minutes. I'll be also be adding some chocolate chips into the cupcakes. I'm gonna try one of these cupcakes. Here it is. First bite. It's very moist. These are actually really good. So like, I would recommend trying Sarah Kim's recipe. These are really good. So maybe, I think it might taste better when you put this in the fridge because like all the chocolate might harden, but I'm not sure, but try this out. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please give a like, subscribe, comment down below whatever you want. Hit the notification bell to know if I this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. To make using like parchment paper, you know, for making cookies or if you're making breads. Like if you're trying to stick something for breads, you can use like butter, just do like grease it and then put it in